Hi, Casper on the 18th of January 2018, and I'm tasting a Greek red actually. This is um, another wine from the Irakis uh, winery on Crete, and it looks to me that this is a red wine that's indigenous to Crete, uh, although it is grown in a few other places, it's genetically identical to another grape under another name that was grown in the Ionian Islands, but seems not to be anymore. But this is Kotsifali, 2015 vintage. Kotsifali, a great variety. Let us taste pale in colour. Really quite pale and garnety looking, I must say. It looks like a, a, an older wine than 2015 would lead you to believe, but there are those varieties that lose their colour quite quickly, like Grenache, um, lose their redness. Uh, so let's have a sniff. Really quite difficult to describe actually. It's it's um it's not a, by any means an aromatic um wine. But there's nice slightly sort of dry, um dry but quite dense aromas of fruits both wild and domestic actually it's got a it's got a hint of something sort of raspberry-ish about it but it also sort of wild wild plums even something slightly earthy or, or rooty about it sort of licorice you know but root root of licorice root not the sweet it's quite an interesting thing to smell actually yeah um if you can give it the time of day, because as I say, it's very unaromatic, so temptation is to gloss over the nose quite quickly. Really interesting, let's have a sip. It's got some really quite elegant structure, a little bit grippy, cool, fine grain, tannins add to this feeling of refreshment um it's a wine that could be served really quite cool i think it's, it's not it hasn't got a massive amount of weight Jancis robertson notes that it can be quite high in alcohol um but this is not it's 13 so it's, it's not a massive great thing um It's really quite a, a nice drinker, actually. I must say, it's, it's, it's no more than medium weight. It's quite a cool thing, you know. None of that, none of that Greek um, sunshine's got into it. It's got super juicy acidity held within this 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 fruit. Um, and again, it's not a not a sweet and overtly ripe palate. Um, you know, it's it's got um, got these uh, these sort of wild fruit flavours, but they're tempered very much by the wine structure. Um, so it comes across as being very unflashy, very cool, really quite elegant uh, 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 as well. Mm. Right. Lovely um, grip and, and length to it, it's, it's persistent and Really, I'm a big fan of this. You know, it's it's not shouting about itself, but it's just a very pretty wine. A little bit of pepperiness, perhaps, at the, at the very finish, but it's going on and on and on. Really interesting wine. I don't think I've ever tasted Cotifali before, but um, now I have, and I'm liking it. May there be many more. 2015 Cotifali from Irarakis Winery on the island of Crete. Got daily drinker all over it.